today's video, I'm going to talk about adjectives, comparatives, and superlatives. Adjectives are very important for sentences. Without them, you can't describe any characteristics or properties of things and person. After you've learned adjectives, you will discover that adjectives are not enough to describe in lots of situations, especially when you want to compare two or more things, person, etc. For example, I want to compare who is more beautiful, who is the tallest, etc. It looks like we forgot one more thing. You need to use comparatives and superlatives. They have some relationships and there are some simple rules between them. After that, you will have enough vocabulary to make sentences completely. I'm going to show you some cases which include adjectives, comparatives, and superlatives at once. And these adjectives are used frequently. Rule 1 one syllable adjective plus er and plus est. Adjectives ending in e plus r and as t. Old. Older. The oldest. Tall. Taller. The tallest. Small. Smaller. The smallest, strong, stronger, the strongest, nice, nicer, the nicest, simple, simpler, the simplest, wise, wiser, the wisest, safe, safer, the safest. Large, larger, the largest. Rule two. Wrong syllable adjective ending in vowel plus consonant usually double the consonant. Big, bigger, the biggest. Fat, fatter. The fattest, hot, hotter, the hottest. Rule three. Two syllable adjectives ending in y change y to i e r and i e s t. Funny, funnier, the funniest. Happy, happier. The happiest, easy, easier, the easiest, pretty, prettier, the prettiest, heavy, heavier, the heaviest, dry, drier, the driest, healthy, healthier, the healthiest. Rule four. Adjectives with two or more syllables usually plus more and plus the most. Important, more important, the most important. Expensive, more expensive, the most expensive. Beautiful, more beautiful, the most beautiful. Friendly, more friendly, the most friendly. Useful, more useful, the most useful. Careless, more careless, the most careless. Rule 5 Some adjectives are regular, such as Number 1 Good, better, the best. 
Number two. Bad, worse, the worst. Number three. Far, farther, the farthest. Number four. Many, more, the most. Number five. Much, more, the most. Number six, little, less, the least. Even with these words, the best way to master the use of adjectives is to write and speak frequently. That way, you will become more and more familiar with them. After we realize the rules above, we should learn how to use comparatives and superlatives. As long as you know the structure of the sentences, you will find that using comparatives and superlatives is not difficult. Structure wrong. We use not as adjective as to say two things are not the same. My pencil case isn't as new as yours. Danny isn't as diligent as Tina. Petrol cars aren't as clean as electric cars. Roller skating is not as fast as cycling. Fast food is not as healthy as vegetables. Structure two: to compare two things or two people in a positive way, we use then after comparative adjectives. Your camera is more expensive than mine. My big sister is taller than me. My English ability is better than my dad's. iPhone is more expensive than any other phone in the world. Robots are more efficient than humans. Structure three. We always use the before superlative adjectives. Tom is the tallest classmate in my class. The Hercules beetle is the biggest rhino beetle. SpaceX is the most famous company which makes electric cars. Tardigrades are the most unique creatures in the world. I believe that you have understood comparative adjectives and superlative adjectives. You can also write notes like me. I want to encourage all of you to practice as often as you can. Welcome all of you to share me your comments and discuss them with me. Thanks for watching my video. See you next time. Mwah.